What's up guys, Higgins of Japan here with another edition of the Friday video. The Friday video is the video that I make right here in my car on the way home from work on a Friday. It's, um, make sure that's all good and done. All right, there we go. Um, and uh, I had another video planned and shot and, and ready to go. Uh, but uh, if you follow news in Japan at all, uh, you might have noticed that uh, there's some things that have changed. And so I'm going to be changing this video. Um, but uh, yeah, so uh, usually I don't really talk about like news in Japan. But um, <clears throat> this is something that directly affects me and so I'm gonna bring it up here in this video but uh, if you hadn't seen or if you had seen or maybe you did not know um, the Prime Minister issued um, a statement uh, yesterday saying that um, he highly recommended that all elementary school junior high and high schools be closed uh, due to the coronavirus and Due to just you know preventive measures of you know if you got a whole bunch of people in an area all together and somebody's sick it's a lot easier for things to spread and so it's a preventative measure uh, just to keep people from getting sick and so uh, that's what's happening um, as far as I know um, so here's the here's the thing because like it's different for different people right so if you're a direct hire English teacher. If you're a dispatch company English teacher, uh, it could be a million different things that it could be, right? So, um, like, you're going to have to just check with, you know, the company you work for and the city that you work for because every place is going to be different um, as to what their requirements are. For right now, um, it's still kind of up in the air for me um, as to what I'm actually going to be doing. My school has already canceled... Um, school from March 2nd until the 24th they've um, started to decide what they're going to do with graduation whether it be some sort of modified graduation where you only um, where only the students come in and the parents um, it could be some sort of modified graduation where it's only the students coming in and picking up their diplomas from the principal um, they haven't even decided that um, part of it yet and so so that's kind of up in the air the other thing is um, you know what are they gonna do with us ALTs they're gonna have us come in and sit around and do nothing for the next month until vacation actually starts um, you know who knows what um, they can actually do that's that for me is still kind of up in the air um, I kind of foresee the fact that I will probably have to go in at least for a short amount of time during the day just to kind of like you know show my presence and and if there's anything that needs to be done English teaching wise then I would be there for that but without any students it's kind of hard to uh, teach English you know uh, so again all of that stuff for me as of right now is still up in the air I don't know um, you know, I talked to my school and they talked to my main school today and they're like, we don't know yet. Like, we think this might happen, but we don't really know for certain. Um, but the main thing is that like for students, um, school is canceled and, you know, just to keep kids away from each other because kids are sick and they're always gross and snotting on everything. And so, um, as much as I love my students, they're gross. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, um, <laughs> basically just keeping everybody away from each other. Um, lots of things are shutting down in Japan. Uh, Disney's shutting down, uh, sporting events are shutting down any type of like large gathering. It's not, um, to the point where it's like, don't leave your house or anything like that, but it's definitely, um, um, it's definitely getting to the point where it's like, okay, everything's shutting down. You need to make sure that. You know, you got medicine or you got masks or you got stuff like that. Uh, the thing is, I was just at a drugstore and the entire mask section was completely empty, completely sold out. Um, the toilet paper section was also like very sold out. Like there were still a few rolls, but it was there were there were a lot of people like at more than what I would see at the um more 
than I, than what I would see at the drugstore on like a normal like weekday afternoon. Um, there were probably at least 20 people per checkout line and it was just this very calm but very like everybody was just like we about to lose our mind and start rolling cars over and setting tires on fire and full blown chaos no it wasn't that bad but it was just very much like everybody here knows what's going on and everybody here knows um, the situation and uh, you walk to the mask section and there's no mask so if you want to go out and be in public um, it's advised that you have a mask um, and so you know masks are all sold out toilet papers all sold out so you know it was kind of this organized very very highly organized chaos right it was like all right i need to get my stuff i need to get in here and get out um but uh yeah so i'm actually headed to another drugstore just to see if they have masks because hey um it, it wouldn't hurt to have one or two or uh, or one or anything if the time does come where you have to like go out of the house for anything and they're saying you can't leave your house unless you have a mask um then it would be nice to have one so i you know if the time comes when i need to go to the grocery store or anywhere um i have a mask so that's kind of the situation that's going on right now um also apparently masks are like thirty dollars on amazon for like one mask like one disposable paper mask like these third party like words that I can't say on my channel, these third party sellers that are jacking the price up, um, on masks, um, public execution. I mean, drag them out of the street. That's, Hey, let's get back to it. Right. Um, make public execution great again. That's my foundation. That's what I'm running on. Uh, Higgins in Japan, 2020. Um, I'm old enough to be elected president and uh, that's my motto. No, but seriously, like, really, like, you're going to charge people hundreds of dollars, literally hundreds of dollars for masks. Like, shame. Shame on you. So, yeah, I'm going to run into this drugstore, uh, not literally or figuratively. Um, I'm just going to actually walk into this drugstore and uh, check it out. Um, this is a new drugstore in town, and so it's usually pretty busy. It's usually about this busy, I would say. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to see if I can find a mask or two. Um, and, uh, I will catch you guys later. Um, I will keep you guys updated if there's anything else to be updated on. Um, so yeah, I have like a little allergy thing going on here. That's why I'm kind of sniffly. It's not, I don't have any sort of cold or anything like that. It's just, just allergies. It's that time of year. Um, and it's that time in Japan when influenza is going around anyways. And so people are being extra careful. So be extra careful. You guys also be extra careful. And uh, that lady just saw me pointing um, at my camera angrily and kind of gave me a weird look. <laughs> so I'm going to go. Uh, you guys have a good one. Uh, check out the links in the in the description below. Um, I have merch on sale. And check it out. Um, you know, because why not plug my merch on a video where I give information about the coronavirus. <laughs> Anyways, catch you guys later. Peace.